You are playing Fortnite or any other game on GeForce Now and you are getting low FPS stutters or FPS drops or the bad internet quality. So guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you the best GeForce Now optimization you need to apply on your PC in order to get the best performance. So make sure to watch this whole video and with the second time, let's dive straight in. So guys, in the very first step, it is always important to guys clean your direct shadow cache because that is causing the stutters and FPS drops every time. So you need to guys go for your window search and search for temp and open up delete temporary file system settings. Now here you will find out this all options you need to just go for this temporary file option. Inside you will find that download, delivery optimization, thumbnail, recycle bean, microsoft defender antivirus, windows error report and direct shadow cache and guys these are all the junk files. So you need to check mark on all the boxes, just simply leave this download one because this can have some personal data which you have downloaded. Now click on the remove file button, hit continue and this will guys start deleting all this junk data from your PC and also reset your directed shader. Next time whenever you launch your game, your GPU will automatically create a new shader cache that will guys resolve the stutters and FPS drops. And guys first time you will get some kind of problem like stutters or FPS drops but with the time that will automatically fix out by your GPU. Now, now in the next step, you need to download this GeForce Now Optimization Pack 2025, link available down in the description, simply go on my website or you can alternately download from my Discord server, link also available in the description. So guys, open up this ARIA file, inside you will find out the folder and here you will find out the three files. First one is the clean DNS, second one is the mouse and keyboard tweaks and then gear a booster txt file for guys improving your network and lowering your ping in fortnite or any other game while you're playing or using the geforce now so guys you need to go for this clean dns but before that you need to guys select all these files and drag it on your desktop and click on the replace the file in the destination so guys here we go over these files so you need to first go for this clean dns folder now here you'll find out clear DNS cache, this will guys clean your DNS cache of your windows and guys help you to lowering your uh, ping and improving your internet speed. So guys right click here and make sure to run this as administrator there for you can have the full access and guys after that now press any key from your keyboard for continue. Now close out of this folder and next here we'll find out our mouse and keyboard tweaks and this is for the input delay. Inside you will find out keyboard optimization mouse optimization, reducer tweak and the RAM optimization. So guys first go for the keyboard optimization and from here you need to guys go for this registry file and guys the change which we have done inside this file that is our keyboard data queue size. So guys this will allow you improving the input delay of your keyboard. So guys simply double tap on the registry, hit yes, hit yes again and click ok. Now go back, go for mouse optimization. We have already done the data queue setting inside it. Simply double tap, hit yes yes again and click ok now you need to go back go for this reducer tweak inside you will find that all these tweaks i have done on your pc that is the game dvr then all the other settings so guys simply double tap here and this will guys apply all these registry changes on your pc this is guys one click solution so make sure to install this registry and download this pack now go back now go for this ram optimization folder inside you will find that every single size of the ram like 2 gb 3 gb 4 gb 6 gb 8 gb 10 12 16 and 32 gb now choose it wisely according to your ram size i have 32 gb so i will go for it if you have the 16 so go for 16. simply double tap on the ram size now hit yes hit yes again and click ok and after that now close out of this directory now at the end here we find out over this gear of booster txt files so open up this txt file and and now from here you need to copy this address from here simply copy it from here go for your any browser simply paste it here and hit enter after that here you will find that official website of the gear of booster click on the get gear of booster and try it for free so guys simply download gear of booster on your pc from the link i have provided and you can guys use the gear of booster for free so guys now the next step we are going to optimize our geforce now settings so guys simply follow all these tweaks also on your pc now the very first step you need to go for this menu option and open up the settings of your geforce now here you will find out all the connection about settings your current membership and everything so guys simply scroll down and find out here first of all the server location settings because this is the only setting that is responsible for the smoothness and quality of your gaming on geforce now and my first priority to set it onto the auto because this will automatically select the best server according to your location the setting will take effect the next time you launch a game so therefore make sure to always set it onto the auto for getting the best performance out of geforce now 
Now you scroll down here, you will find out the streaming quality that this guy has also adjusts their performance and data usage. Actual data performance may vary based upon your network connection and system. So guys, the best purity I suggest that is the custom settings I personally like. And here you will find that all the controls. So guys, now you need to go for this max bitrate settings. Here you will find it auto. I suggest to go with the custom one. If you are using the free plan, you can simply set the slider onto the 50 Mbps because this is the one of the best settings and also recommended by the Nvidia itself. If you are using the premium package, so guys go with the auto one. But if you are using the free, so you can go with the custom with 50 Mbps speed. Now here we got the resolution set on 1920 by 1080 p Next here we got this frame rate and here we got the 60 FPS limit because we are using the free plan. If you are using the premium one, you can go with the 120 or 240 FPS in Fortnite or any any other game next here we go the v-sync so guys go for the slider and turn off the v-sync from your pc now next here we go the vrr display reflex and hdr mode this is disabled on the free plan but with the premium one you can guys access all the settings next here we go this color precision here you will find the settings like 8 bit or 10 bit it's not matter a lot but guys with the 10 bit you will get vibrance color in your game but guys with the free plan you are limited on the 8 bit and with the premium you can set it on the 10 bit now next here is the most important settings if you have the low internet settings so guys here we go to the adjust for poor network connection so guys you need to turn on the settings this will automatically adjust if your internet speed will go down and guys make your game stable now scroll down and here you will find that the resolution quality this setting will help you to making the quality of your game sharp and clear using the ai but guys the best setting which i suggest that is the standard one so guys i always play on the standard now scroll down inside you'll find out in-game graphic settings this is turned off right now you can change the settings in game itself this setting is just for the premium user where you can adjust the settings outside of the game so guys i hope so you love all the optimization please make sure let me know your opinion about this optimization for geforce now in the comment below and if this video help out you so guys make sure drop a like and i will see you in the next video